<laughs> Whoa! We are on an adventure to get the world's greatest hot dog. And by, or corn dog actually, greatest corn dog. And I am super excited because my sisters have talked this up. My dad has said it's really good. So I am super, super, super excited to try these corn dogs because I love corn dogs. <coughs> He's gonna try it. I will find myself a taco truck and I will have tacos. World's best corn dogs. Awesome. Oh my goodness, what do you have? Corn dog. He's a corn dog. Wow, that is huge. No, it's a little. That's a little one? Oh, it's chilly. It's windy. <laughs> so, it, Saren, if this is a little one, then what do the big ones look like? Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is. It's a meal and a half. Yes, you just heard that right. I'm not going to repeat it again because it's never going to happen again. You guys, he's eating a corn dog. Look at these things, they're dinners. Watch him eat this corn dog. Ow. Okay, you you get that corn dog. Yum yum yum. Yummy yummy yummy. KSL FM. KSL. Have we told them why I don't like corn dogs? No, I don't know why you don't like corn dogs. Go get a soda. I will. I'm um, gonna feed this girl. Saren even likes them. What you forgot about the hot dog? Get the hot dog. Mmm. Did you get it? Good. Hi, Ann. Freezing cold. Freezing cold. Winter. Ah. No, it's winter. spring now. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at her. Monkey girl. Oh, I'm trying to crawl now. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's try this one. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Get a little top heavy for a second. Okay, let's try again. Oh, get back up. Get back up. <laughs> oh, I found my foot. I want to eat it. Are you sure you want to do that? Are you sure about this? Here, here. Said no jumping. No jumping. What? Yes, I can. No jumping. You rebel. We're trying it again. This time, however, we are only doing part of it, and we're seeing if it'll take. If it takes, then then we'll move to a different part. But we're we're just thinking that this is going to be a better option, because now Kaya has almost full reign of the yard, whereas before she didn't. So we shall see how this goes with seeding and grass. Wish us luck. My arms are very tired. Lots of tilling and that tiller didn't work so it was all man labor I felt like I was back in the stone age well, I guess the pioneer age yeah that age okay so I did a nine mile run with my dad this morning it was really cold and they didn't have the camera on me because I didn't have a lot of storage but Alex is doing his nine mile run right now and we are going to get him and I have one of his favorite songs ready to play as soon as I can find him I found dad can't see him. Jim, no more Jim, no more Jim, no more Jim. Gonna live to the moon. Gonna live in the pool. <laughs> Gonna talk to Roxanne and I feel like a fool. Cause after today I'm gone. After today, after today she'll be mine. I'm a 41 image, a comic in the mix. And down with the textbook. Oh my goodness, that was a fantastic run. It's interesting, you know, since I've gone through like all my classes of studying how the body works and the systems that it uses to get energy to the muscles and everything. 
right at around the five mile marks, so about 45 minutes into the run, all of a sudden, I like. Get my mac and cheese in there. <laughs> she wants to get her mac and cheese over there. Mama, uh, I want to get her mac and cheese over there. Sam, that's an expensive mac and cheese. Yeah, the, the ones that we have at home is cheaper, okay? And taste about the same. But right at about the 45 minute mark, all of a sudden I just got this burst of energy and I was like, whoa, hello. And Kelsey was saying that they ran into that this morning on their run too, huh? Yeah, it was the, I'm so freaking cold. <laughs> it was 34 degrees when me and my dad went running this morning. That was cold. <laughs> yeah. anyway, we never got warm. I had to go to the bathroom at mile seven. I couldn't hold it anymore. And my dad's like, how is it pulling up your pants? I was like, I couldn't feel anything, so it was fine. <laughs> So yeah, we both ran eight and a half, nine miles today, and oh, thank you fat cells for uh, giving me that burst of energy to keep on going. It's a good run, very good run. Now, I'm hungry, and I'm ready to just go home and veg, but first to Target Ball, and this is the last Saturday of Target Balling, and we know what we're gonna do today. Stop blogging! Okay.